had a chance to check out the sights? Yeah, Scottish Brad has been showing me around. I'm hoping to see the Kelvin Grove Museum later on. That's still on my list. I wish you wouldn't call him that. I feel strangely threatened. He's Scottish, and his name is Brad. Well, Bradford. Yeah, I know. Oh, Brad. I hate it when you get jealous. I'm not jealous. I just don't like the sound of... The sound of what? Nothing's happening. He's just taking me to a museum. Relax. Fine, but I don't want you eating any haggis. Okay. I guess. Love you. Love you, too. Sometimes that man... Hi. How is your Yankee love doing, Corny? Hey, Scottish Brad. Yeah, U.S. Brad is okay. He just gets so insecure sometimes. What is this insecure? Insecure. Aye, insecure. That's when a person doesn't have a lot of confidence in themselves from time to time. Brad's usually a pretty together guy, but he's got his moments. Aye, that sounds like my fair Conradine. That lass is full of spit and venom, then. She's got the big knockers, though. Don't be forgetting that, Bradford. Chadwick, I'll be asking you kindly not to be so derogatory. I didn't mumble, wanker. Hey, who comes to painting, Connie? Your artistic beauty is second only to your stunning grace. I caught a couple of those words. If you're asking about how the painting is going, it's coming along. Your office will swatch out when you're Dean. What? He says the office will be a wee bit all right when you are done. We are under attack, I tell ya. Condradine just took out Orion. This is bull, Jubby. Ah, ah, I tried to go in north, sir, sir. Verily. I be looking for the American whore who's after my child. Oh, can. Is she talking about me? What's a chill? You better settle this bony, Bradford. Quit bony. Condradine, what is the meaning of this? I've seen the way you swatch at her. I will avenge my honor and barony for the child I love. Hey, whoa. There's nothing going on here, okay? Scottish Brad is just... A sort of co-worker, that's all. Right, Bradford? Bradford? I cannot live with the law anymore. Corny, I am in love with you. <gasps> I have been since the first magical day you came into the office. Well, I'll be damned. That's bull, Jobby. Ah, I can it. I have you now, Bradford. You have broken my heart, Bradford. Now I will return the favor. Criminy. I understood that one pretty well. Get it new. This is not how we decide such affairs. Maggie Bunny! Maggie Bunny! <coughs> ah, Johnny. It's that damn bald bag, Cosmo. I told you not to put pants on it. But it looks so bonny. Get her out of here, Bradford McThompson. We'll hold off Connor Dean for as long as we can. I haven't seen this much passionate rage since my honeymoon with... Mrs. Sire. Good enough, need a ride in here. What are you doing? That's my motor, fella. Bless the gas, they're coming. They're on us. Shake them off. No! You'll regret the day you tried to nade the child out of my dreams, you evil witch. Did she just call me a witch? Hey, did you just call me a witch? What if it be if I did? You hinting out to do something about it, you thieving lassie. <laughs> oh, that is it. I am not a dog. That's not what she said. Let the Maggie Barney proceed, Bradford. It is our way. No! My motor! Ah! Ah, I see you have fighting skills. So much the better. Twelve years of Tybo, Red. Criminy! Uh, 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 there can uh, be only one. Fine. Uh, you broke my bonny beak, you off your haggis. Ah! Oh my god, that was amazing. Hey, Kelvin Grove Museum!